Saneri. Saneri, and we're getting a, a fight here. Right in the middle. Yeah, it's a couple big haymakers. Throwing it down. Grass making sure no one else joins in. What a big takedown there. Call no, nope. waved off because Brockville beat his man over front. Oh, call Hain. Call Hain bumped the goalie, and now we have Gorgon. We got some action going on here as everybody's discussing tonight's supper. Now we got number 49 here, Arango and Coulter. Big fight. Carolyn. Montgomery Parsons. Oh, oh, that's a big hit up high, and Shawnaker seems to be okay, but here's going to be a fight with the pawn. Montgomery's going up just a pawn as well. There's multiple fights breaking out at the blue line. That one, I don't think, I don't know if this is a warranted reaction coming out here. Two on one, Shoniker trying to get his licks in too, but that was just an accidental hit. I don't think it was an intentional. And one of the Dukes took his jersey off and it's going right back at the punt. Lorzel throws it in. We have the last minute announcement coming on. Punt gets hit hard. Oh. And he doesn't like, he throws his glove in his, and the stick of Borg. Punt's going to go to the box for that. And Borg is getting harassed this time by... Mitchell, and there's another, another fight breaking fight. out. It's Mitchell and Borg. And the closer, it's Gill actually who's in the corner. So another fight. Gill trying to land some rights on Mitchell. Mitchell getting some in himself, and they get taken down by the linesman. Penalty coming up against the Kings. Trotchy shoots. Rebound is there. Oh, Jones made a big stop with the pad. Keeps it out, and we've got more pushing and shoving. Trotchy is into it. A couple of gloved punches there from Holmes. Here Holmes wants to go. We got a fight brewing, and the lineys are getting in the middle of oh, it. Let them go. Four gloved punches are being thrown. These lineys want nothing to do with it. They're going to get free, and they're going, boys. They're going in the corner, a big takedown, Parker Holmes. Tracy, he's from Stouffville, Ontario. Uh, Nolan Turnbull now for the Nats. Ooh, Ooh. and that was a big hit by... No, Brandon, Brandon Coggle, here we go. Oh, oh, we have ourselves a fight. And you have Jack Tracy throwing punches. And whoa, these guys are throwing big bombs at each other. And the Rockland Nationals bench as... Shoot. And that's blocked by Murdoch out to center. Arges again, D to D. Here's Waugh off the right boards ahead. We got a fight. Here we go. It is Windsor and Kyle Slingeland facing off. Both of them tangled up. Uppercut from Windsor. Another right by Windsor once again getting punches in. He takes down Slingeland to the ice. Same with Windsor. Hold off for Speedy. That was a bit of fighting. Here goes Savignac. Savignac and Stolers are going to go at it. Right in front of the Navin bench. Savignac gets a left. And they both go down. 
in quick succession. Those two guys were showing at each other for a while. Walls trying to send it in. Big hit along the wall here. Tallman chips the puck ahead. There, there we go. We got oh, a fight here. Here we go. Oh, boy. Brendan Boyce. Oh. Pops his helmet off. Boyce going at it. Boyce is... I, I, I give this to the boys. There's a lot more. Oh. Agileta. This is off to Henderson. A hard check here by Paquin on Magileta, and he will draw a crowd. In fact, a fight. Paquin going after. Uh, he would be gone from the game anyways. So Paquet makes sure that uh, Josh Reed went after him. Throws it in front and Maselli just hops on that. Now Ergon throwing some gloves there. With McDonald and Soloway. And there's like a wrestling match going on now on this side here. Soloway is going toe to toe. This has turned into a fight. Soloway and Kobe Lazone are going at it. Lazone throwing punches at Soloway, the Canadian's captain, trying to return just as many as he's receiving. And Lozone gets the takedown. Line, his shot is deflected right in front. And uh, it finds its way to Benoit Forge. And now we got a fight. We've got number 10 for Cornwall, Tristan Miron who uh, obviously some frustration in front of the net. I do believe it's with Liam Carroll for Rockland as the officials finally get between the two combatants. Esposito for Colhane and a big save there by Jones. Right after I said that, a great chance there for the Braves and Esposito going at it with Penna, and we're going to get a fight here. Nick Esposito and Easton Penna. Esposito frustrated for the Rockville Braves. Going at it hard there with Easton Penna. Ferris back for it. Now Phillips gets locked up. Well, Mitchell with a shove there. Mitchell wants a piece of Phillips, and now the official gets taken down in the process. Here we go. Carrier in a battle with Graziano. The official down as Phillips went right in after Mitchell wanted to come back for seconds. Wilson's grabbed the man. Graziano still holding tight on Carrier. And now they're starting to throw. Wilson and Seferis together. Graziano trying to drag his man down. Graziano with the right. Another right by Carrier. Graziano again with the right over the top. Another left by Carrier. Graziano, jersey grab, Carrier in with the left, a right by Graziano, a right by Carrier, and down they go, fight night at the pond, oh wow, mercy. Trying to cut his way in, it's steered aside as, now Doc Satter with a huge hit on Indefo, as Woods coming at him, and the both guys going to drop their... Gloves and helmet, Francis Woods has no helmet off as Dockstatter throwing some rights and left and they go down. Scalise, but it's going to go back into the neutral zone. Oh, hold on. And here we go. What's happening here? Perron is getting into a tackling match and Wall is throwing punches right now. Rips his helmet off and here we go. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see what happens here as two linesmen are trying to haul Wall off of Perron. Flipped in softly by Corey Jewett. Back to Seferis. Blind pass looking out in front for DePaulo. That's again going to be disconnected and then a hard hit thrown away. Seferis and Wasselin going to go at each other. They want to drop the gloves. There might be a second fight in two games for the Dukes and Joey Wasselin does not want to go. Seferis wants to have a little tete-a-tete -tete with him and Joey Waslin is making it very clear he does not want to gain the five-minute major and a game misconduct and also a uh, potential suspension on it now they're letting they're letting them go though which is the funniest part about this Dimitri Seferis is fully committed to this bout no I believe that because uh, that's where Hunter uh, McKnight is living is at Legree so here we go fight 
McKnight is going at it, throwing some right, and he's actually got a nice. I think it's number 20, Arango. Yeah, it is. He was covered back to Cooper, Aiden Cooper with it. Now the quarterback, quick shot. Save. Carlton plays. Oh, yeah, you got to call that big cross checking in front. Picking on the wrong man. Oh, oh my God. They picked on the wrong man. in the slot he's looking to jam at home penalty on the way for the Colts and then he's knocked into the into the net and now Bjorn's exchanging Poirier's there Colt is trying to peel him off his man there's going to be some multiple penalties here Dagenet Bjorn going at it still with the linesman in the zone and now they're resorting to blows as Bjorn and Kobe Lazone are going at it Bjorn gets a takedown Lazone gets back up and is throwing more hands Bjorn's on the ice getting thrown around like a rag doll. The linesman trying to throw his body in front of the two of them to break it up. And that gets a roar from both benches as Lazone, who fought here last time. The refereeing team here. Oh, and here we go. Oh, and we have a fight. Briggs show it against Jacob Windsor. Hard punches thrown by Windsor. Joey now getting up. He's trying to take his helmet off. He's going. Joey breaks him down. And you want a spark? There it is. Graham who gets a stick on it. Takes a check by Morris. 8.05 left period number three. Fight happening here. Morris and Graham are going to go at it. Graham's delivering right hands. He spins around and takes Morris down to the ice. Here's Holmes with Marion. Holmes fires, he scores! Colin Holmes, seventh of the year. And there's pandemonium behind the net. And the coach just threw something at the referee on the Brockville bench. And here we go, lots of fighting. Oh my, the Brockville head coach Can't tell which one it is. Two assistant coaches on the... Well, Joe has his helmet off, and he just took down two Braves on his own. There's a third. Oh, and he's going to be knocked out. Scary scenes here in the Memorial Center. Stops. Sends it over for Bloom. That pass just... Oh, look out. And then here we go. As Bloom gets into a star's neck. And we have a fight in the corner. Ouellette for Stevenson. And he's checked from behind by Muguntin, and this is going to be a penalty to Muguntin. And then Hamity comes in and starts throwing bombs on Muguntin after that. Back the other way, Foley for Pembroke. Oh, there we go. This has been long brewing. Adam Walker takes his man down. Here's Walker. Out for the Colts. Van Perron, oh. they have it at center. Big collision. Both guys back up oh. again. And we're going to get a fight. This is involving Esposito. And I can't tell who else it is. Oh, it's Boyce. Esposito and Boyce throwing haymakers. Heavy, heavy rights from Boyce. And you got to give him the decision there. 
Becky up high who makes the save. Puck comes down and a big hit there from Soar as he stood up Colby Lazan. And now they're going to fight. Soar and Lazan are going to go. Soar took his bucket off and he's taken left from Lazan who didn't want to take his bucket off to fight. to center. Hard check in front of the Rockland bench by Mum. And now we got more pushing and shoving. Mum's going to get... Mum takes the gloves off. He's got two Raider players. Mum along with Scalisi and they are wrestling to the ice and Mum... Since in front of the net he was looking for a tip. Look out. Look out. And now a penalty's coming up here against Bolshman. And Tom, they give him the business as they have a, a brouhaha at the side of the goal. And now we have a fight. Order in there. Hawks, Bray Hawks. Now they'll roll it right around. Oh! Big check yeah. on the play. Big Nate Pearson having uh, a little discussion. He's just giving it to him. Nate Pearson feeding. I'm not sure who that is. There's a big hit from behind. I don't mind uh, the retaliation when it's the same no. player that's getting it. Yeah. Spec Meek now with a minute 54 remain. Puck sent right back oh, around. Oh, oh. Stubbings grabbed a hold of Pike's mask. And here we go, a little fight here. Pike's a pretty tough customer. Can't punch as the guy... Oh, oh pulls his hair! Pulled his hair! <laughs> now he, Pike grabs his mask. It all started because number 14 grabbed the hole of Mr. Pike's helmet and started face masking. Boucher on this far side looks for Colhane, just chipped away at the last moment. Colhane uh, taken down hard by Arango, and uh, Colhane not very happy with that. And now they're going to go at it, I think. Need a couple of uh, teammates at one time. Colhane wrestles his man to the ice. I think they're both willing to tangle on that one. Loses it. Mom all alone in his shot is deflected to the right of the net. Now we got sticks and here goes Mum. Mum's got the gloves off behind the net and we've got a fight so they will both be going to the dressing room. Mum with Alec McDonald. McDonald with the helmet off now. McDonald and Mum and this has been brewing for quite a while. Regroup and try the near side. They're going to get it all the way into the zone as they chase it all the way, chase it all the way into the zone as he uh, took down two players and then one player's injured as he got cross checked right in the back. And Finnegan Camurri is going to lay some lumber on Roy, I think. That was a dirty play by Roy in the corner and no call. And that's Cornwall Colts for a nice play. Great by the stanchion. Say, Pike you. sends it up the wing. But quite coming in, drops it back, quick shot. And these two try to take the shot, man. Oh, here we go. We got a fight going on here. Colby Lozo. I don't know who the other guy is. Maybe face masking, I think, though. Oh. Colby Lozo going out. They finally get the... Oh, what a shot by Lozo. Oh, Colby Lozo! Bellpoint blocked every punch with his face. Raiders. And Saturday afternoon for the season ender against an Abbott. Oh, here we go. Walker and I'm not sure. Number, number seven, seven versus Patton. Oh! oh, oh Walker! Oh, 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 oh. Walker go. He's oh. beating him. Walker. Uh, Got the best, although for speeding, was able to take him down. Tied up in there, all kinds of bodies. 
And now McKnight going at it with McIntosh. McKnight going off on Alex McIntosh, who seemingly didn't want anything to do with Hunter McKnight. Picked up by the net by Fort Chang. He gets tangled up there with Brown. And we're going to have a penalty on the play as Brown throws him off. And now Brown's going to get tangled up with the other Fort Chang. And they're both going for a Brown's helmet is off. He's swinging. He wants to go, Kiki Brown. He is heated. Linesman going to have to hold him back there. Brown and Forche not happy with each other. As he steps on Forche's stick and tries to break it in two. Anderson. Oh. Oh. Don't need that. Third man in right there. And they're fighting. Oh, yeah. Number 11 gets a penalty. Down to the corner. He gets pinned to the wall down there. As they're just having a bit of a wrestling match down there with, looks like Graham on top of him. Now there's some punches being thrown. And now we're going to finally get a whistle. And some fists are flying here. And a helmet is off. We've got some big fists being thrown down there. Chase Letourneau off the crossbar. And he went to the right of the net. And a hard check there by Brady on Dolan. Just outside. Now we got a fight. We've got Brady and uh, number 77, Isaac Enright. And the punches are flying. Brady, Enright are going at it. And uh, Brady goes down. Enright will get the win. Wilson up over the center ice over the blue line. Wilson trying to get it in. Hunter McKnight with hits his man on the sideboard. Horton after. We got a scrap going here. Wilson pounding away on O'Connor. Good wrestling match there at the end. Looking big shot. Fraser tipped up front. Oh, no. Not now, buddy. You'll be out the next game. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. That's all. Absolutely nothing. Center. Drez. Bumped up hard by Jowett. And Drez kind of bumped the header or so. And Drez is asking to go with Jowett. And Jowett and Drez are going to go. We're going to go fight in the Navid zone. Jowett throws a left and Drez caught Jowett and they both go down. Oh my. To the crease in the center ice. 18 seconds left. Now, there, now the cheering now starts on the bench. The bench is, uh, uh, under under 20 <laughs> seconds and... Uh, and that, that'll be it. Nobody's going to bring this one up the ice. Thank you. We'll that, that clock went out. And the grabs are throwing their sticks to the ice. Uh, Everything is littered. And, and, uh, and you, have a, you have a group of boys that uh, uh, haven't been here before. And so much disappointment for the Bears.